people ask me what I do and I tell them I'm a time management coach, one of the first questions they ask me is, why time management? What ever got you into that? And my answer is that it started with a simple Christmas gift. So here is Captain Time's origin story. Many years ago, I worked in middle management for a large bank. My manager at the time gave me a very lovely Christmas gift of a red leather bound day timer with my initials uh, engraved into it. My first thought was, oh, what a lovely gift. My second thought was, wait, is he insinuating I'm not organized? But in truth, I think it was genuinely a lovely gift. As I put the binder together and assembled it, I was blown away at the level of thought that had gone into it. Not only were there spots for my calendar appointments, but also for my to-do list, my expenses, meeting notes, client notes, and even goal setting. And this totally transformed my thinking about time management. This one simple binder, no bigger than a hardcover book, transformed my work and my life. But that was only the beginning. I became obsessed with time management. I Every book I could find on time management, I could lay my hands on, I read obsessively. I listened to audio tapes in my car on time management. I looked at every possible time management resource I could find. I studied all the major productivity systems because I wanted to master this for me. But I was in management. So when you're managing things, you also pass this on to your subordinates and your team members. So I started teaching my team members, my colleagues, how to do this. Later, I became self-employed in the field of internet marketing, which I also loved. And I did that for many years. And I used what I had learned about time management for myself and for my clients. And I would teach my clients time management as well. But at some point, I became kind of I disgruntled with the whole internet marketing field, and I decided to pivot and teach time management full time. So the next step was to test the branding. And at 2 a.m. in the morning, when all bad ideas come out, the idea of Captain Time came from the chaos. I tested my branding with some of my existing friends and co colleagues and clients, and they absolutely loved it. So that's how Captain Time was born, the whole origin story. The time hat came later, but that is another story.